Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Before we get started, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to my channel. How to choose the perfect dog breed. So make sure to watch the full video. It takes more than just looking at a nice face to pick the perfect dog breed for you. Although you may believe that you are choosing a certain breed to meet your personal wants, it's equally important to take the dog's needs into account. If you're a potential pet owner seeking to provide a dog with a loving home are you prepared to select the best dog for you? Making the decision to get a new dog is a big one. Prior to beginning the procedure, be sure you are prepared to adopt a dog you must also be aware of how much owning a dog will cost. If you've determined that the moment is now, congrats! Now is the moment to decide which breed of dog is best for you. Before selecting a dog, you need to take into account a number of variables. Examine your existing way of life and decide what changes you are willing to make to accommodate a dog, which is most vital. Take into consideration your family's demands, particularly if you have young children, elderly relatives, or other pets. Although some allergy sufferers will still experience symptoms with these breeds, people with allergies or people who like low shedding dogs may want to consider hypoallergenic dog breeds. Secondly, consider the perfect age, size, and energy level for your new dog. Please keep in mind that getting a dog typically necessitates a strong commitment to good dog ownership for 10 to 15 years. Here are some suggestions to assist you in selecting the ideal dog for you and your family. Size You might already be set on a large or enormous dog breed, or you might already know you want a small lap dog you can carry around. A medium-sized dog might be an excellent option if you can't make up your mind please keep in mind that some little canines are more fragile and prone to damage. Serious injury can result from being mishandled or stepped on little dogs may also be more susceptible to colder temperatures, so be prepared to keep them warm. Due to their diminutive stature, they could also require more frequent feedings and bathroom breaks than some larger dogs, making them have higher maintenance. Little dogs also require obedience training, so keep that in mind. Little dogs are sometimes not trained as consistently since they are simple to pick up and remove bodily from. Challenging situations this might result in undesirable habits like snarling, nipping, or a persistent need for attention. Make sure you are equipped to handle this scenario very huge canines require a little more room to maneuver. To prevent tail injuries or damage to household items, Large, happy dogs with long, whip-like tails require a wagging room. The cost of the dog is another factor to take into account. The bigger the dog, the more expensive dog food, dog supplies, and medical care are another important element is training. If you buy a large or giant breed puppy and let him act like a lap dog when he's young, he'll grow up to essentially walk all over you. Degree of Activity you likely already know that different dogs are more excitable than others. The breed is frequently a determinant of a dog's activity level. However, breed alone should not be used to predict how active your dog might become. Regardless of breed or size, all dogs require regular exercise, so make sure you can give it to them every day. A lower energy dog, like a Basset Hound, would probably be best for you if you know you cannot commit to more than one or two casual walks each day. Consider the Border Collie breed if you're searching for a canine partner for jogging, an agility competitor, or a disc dog. Be prepared to modify the amount of exercise and care you provide your dog if necessary. A dog who is acting out in various ways, such as digging up your yard, damaging your house, or barking non-stop, may require further training, mental stimulation, and activities. Excessive energy makes a lot of behavioral issues worse it is crucial to conduct research and ensure the dog you want is compatible with your lifestyle. Because many dogs are sadly given up or even put to sleep due to behavioral issues that may result from a lack of socialization, exercise, training, and attention. Maintenance of the body. The amount of upkeep required for your dog depends greatly on how he looks basic grooming is required for all dogs. However, Depending on their coat type, some breeds may require more. Advanced routine grooming is necessary if you obtain a dog with hair that keeps growing be prepared to undertake additional cleaning because most short-haired, smooth-coated. Dogs shed a lot certain grooming tools can aid in minimizing shedding know that dogs with long, 
floppy ears are more likely to get ear infections and may need frequent, in-depth ear cleanings. Furthermore, a lot of small breed dogs are susceptible to dental illness, which may necessitate pricey operations as well as devoted regular brushing at home. Moreover, some dog breeds have a propensity for excessive drooling. A slobber cloth is frequently carried by owners of breeds like mastiffs, bloodhounds, and related dogs to catch the drool. Pay attention if they shake their heads. Age puppies need the most instruction and care, especially during the first six months. Prepare yourself to spend a lot of time training and raising your new dog. Your dog will definitely poop a lot in the house and maybe chew your furniture and personal items. Patience is required, but these issues will eventually disappear with committed training. Also, if you adopt a mixed breed dog, you should be aware that your puppy may develop differently than you had anticipated. This is just something to keep in mind, not necessarily a bad thing. A wonderful option is adult dogs if you want to get a solid sense of your new dog's actual energy level, attitude, and temperament, an adult might be a better option. You should still anticipate some level of first concentrated training since the dog is not necessarily trained just because he is an adult. Many mature dogs, thankfully, have some training and socialization under their belts, so they may readily adapt to their new life in their forever homes. It's important to remember senior dogs. A wonderful way to make a senior dog happy in its later years is to welcome one into your home. Senior dogs, sadly, have a lower chance of being adopted and frequently end up dying in shelters or being put to sleep. Energy Level If you're looking for a dog with less energy, a senior dog can be a wonderful companion. Yet it's crucial to understand that your older dog requires particular care, and more frequent veterinarian examinations, and is more prone to experience health issues that require time and money to fix you must understand that you won't have as long a relationship with your senior dog as you would with a puppy or adult dog. Think about adopting an older dog if you're prepared to shoulder the obligations it might be one of the kindest things you can do for these priceless animals. Dog Breed There is no denying the popularity of purebred dogs for a variety of reasons. Many individuals are drawn to particular dog breeds. Perhaps you were raised with a breed or have had a lot of experience with it, maybe you have a deep affection for a particular breed's appearance and behavior. Alternatively, you might believe the breed is a good fit for you based on what you've read or heard about it. Make sure to do extensive research on the breed if you want a purebred dog. You should decide if you are prepared to face potential difficulties related to temperament, grooming requirements, and health issues. Verify that the breed will mesh well with your family and way of life, including any other dogs after that. Make sure to find a trustworthy dog breeder. Dogs of mixed breeds. Dogs of mixed breeds might develop into fantastic additions to your household in many cases. The personalities and physical traits of two or more dog breeds can be balanced out. But remember to prepare for the unexpected, particularly if you choose to adopt a pound puppy. You cannot really predict health issues or the exact appearance your puppy will have as an adult. Numerous professionals concur that mixed breed dogs experience fewer health issues than purebred dogs. They are generally unique and intelligent and make excellent companions. Additionally, by adopting a mixed breed dog, you typically prevent its euthanasia or lonely existence in a shelter history. You will be aware of the dog's history if you purchase from a dog breeder the history can be murkier if you're adopting from an animal shelter. The past can have an impact on the personality of your dog, who may have been abandoned or even abused. But just because they have a troubled past doesn't mean they won't be the ideal dog for you. You simply have to be prepared to put in the effort. The French Bulldog, Winston, was named by AKC as the most popular breed the Labrador Retriever which was the most frequently chosen dog for 2021, lost. To the French Bulldog this year, like Winston, who paid a visit to the GMA studio on Wednesday morning, the French Bulldog is America's most popular breed. So, that's it for today. We hope you enjoyed the video. Use the comments section below to tell us what you think about the video. Also, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click the bell button to be notified of all the latest videos.